Welcome back to the Guru. Today I'm going to show you how to use Dmail, which is a Chrome extension that allows you to revoke sent emails or send self-destructing emails. This is similar to the Gmail feature Undo Send, which allows you to undo sent emails up to 30 seconds after you've already sent them. But this goes a little bit further and allows you to undo sent emails no matter how long it was since you sent them, or to send emails with a certain time limit that'll be revoked after that time limit is complete. So the first step is to go to the Chrome Web Store, search for Dmail in the top left, and then we'll find this, and we'll click Add to Chrome, click Add, and you may get permissions here that'll ask you to accept. And once you've accepted those permissions, we'll go back into Gmail, and we'll compose a new email, and we'll click Dmail on. We'll type in a recipient as if we're writing a regular email. Write whatever you want for the subject line. So we have the option for this email to be destroyed either never, in one hour, in one day, or one week. So for displaying how this works, we'll choose never because you still have the option to destroy this email manually after you've sent it. So we'll send this email. And now let's take a look at what this looks like from the recipient standpoint. So as you can see, the recipient has an email with the subject line self-destruct, which is the one we just sent. And if we click into it, this email is actually encrypted, so they can't see the message from right here. We'll click View Message. And we can see the message right there. And if the recipient has this extension installed, then they will actually be able to see the message right in the Gmail interface. They won't have to click out to a new web page like this. So let's go back into the Guru's email and self-destruct this message. So we'll go to our sent mail and we'll find that message that we sent and we'll click revoke email in the top right. We'll ask you if we're sure. We'll click OK. And now that email is not viewable to the recipient anymore. So let's take a look now at the recipient's email inbox. So we still see the email here. We can see the subject line. And if we click View Message, it says Message Unavailable, since we revoked that message. So this can be great for secure communication or for if you mistakenly send an email and you want to take it back or anything like that. Hope this has been helpful. And if you have any comments or questions, please leave them in the comments section below. Thank you and have a great day.